How do we make water safe to drink? The process starts with source water, the water serving the area. This could be a surface water supply, such as a river, stream, or lake, or it could be an underground well. Coagulation is the first step in the water treatment process. Coagulation typically uses iron or aluminum-based chemicals to form sticky particles that bind with dirt and organic matter in the water. Slow mixing is then used to cause coagulated dirt and organic particulates to collide and clump together to form larger flock particles that can settle out of the water later in the process. The heavy particles, or flock, settle out and the clear water flows to the next step. The settled solids removed from the process often possess exceptional nutrient and water retaining properties that allow them to be recycled or reused. The clarified water passes through filters made of layers of sand, coal, or activated carbon, which helps remove smaller particles, including some potentially harmful bacteria. During the final step of treatment, chlorine is added to treat pathogens that may remain in the water following the prior treatment stages. The water is stored temporarily in a clear well to give the chlorine time for the disinfection process to occur. Pumps are then typically used to push the water through pipes to homes and businesses in the community. Water quality is routinely sampled and analyzed throughout the treatment process and distribution system to provide safe, clean, reliable drinking water to homes and businesses. Tanks are often used to provide storage around the distribution system to help maintain pressure and enhance reliability of water service and fire protection. Want to know more about water? Visit our online learning center at amwater.com.